Hey guys, how's it going? This is Karol Fuller from Undisputed Marketer and if you're watching this video, you're probably wondering about how to stay positive and happy all the time. So in this video, we're going to dive deep into this topic and we're going to actually look at the ways how you can achieve just that. So first of all, before we go into any details, we gotta understand that positiveness and happiness are two different things, right? Uh, happiness comes from within. That means you know what you feel inside and you know the happiness is derived from all the things that you are doing on your daily in your daily lives on your daily basis so that means you know whether you are fulfilled if you are doing what you want to do if you are you know heading towards the right direction if you are focusing on your passions on what really matters for you deeply inside and you know you cannot really push happiness you know you cannot really you know be like okay i am happy now and this is it because you know if you are in a job or you know you are in a you know nine to five job that you really hate you don't really like it's not not something that you're passionate about you don't really enjoy working in it you cannot push yourself to being happy that you are in this job right so you cannot be like okay i'm happy because I am here right if it is not something that really fulfills you then you cannot really push it you need to change that and you need to focus on those things that really matter for you that are that you are really passionate about and that really brings the happiness the the joyfulness the joy and you know the likeness inside of you that comes literally from within the happiness. It's literally the daily life you are doing and all those activities that you are doing, if, if they are something that you are really passionate about and brings you know all the good into your life and around your, your, your circumstance, your environment and all of this stuff. So you need to focus on this. Now, positiveness is a whole different thing. Positiveness is literally the perception, the, your perception about specific either activity, either environmental uh, action or you know circumstance, whatever it is. Positiveness is literally the perception, the point of view, how you how you look at the things in your life. That means you know whenever the, you have um, some circumstance, you know something happens in your life, and you, you know you have two options. You can either look at the good things about that particular situation or you can look at the negative things right and you can literally do this with any activity any situation in your world you can always find the good good things and you can always find the bad things no matter what situation it is you know uh, even if it would be the the greatest thing in the world the greatest achievement in your world if you would really want to find the negative things for that achievement you will find it find them I will guarantee you this and that applies also to any negative situation that you are experiencing in your life right it doesn't really matter what it is it can be the worst thing that you ever experience you can always find the good things in that situation as well now being the point of view and the perception about the situation you can always look at it and you can always look for the good things if you want to be positive then look for those good things now when whenever there is a negative situation you know we tend to you know focus on on the negative things on you know what what never happened or you know what what negative aspects of of our life will be changed because of the situation all of this stuff you know we are used to it we are grow uh, we grew up focusing on those negative things that we don't have you know those things that we don't have however you can change that and you can really focus on the good things now um, if you have any negative situation you know you can always look for and this is what I do on a daily basis is that every negative situation is a lesson to, to be learned in your in your life now whenever something negative happens it is a reflection of your state of mind of your of your past experiences and your past you know actions and activities you know 
and that, that basically applies to positive things as well. So whenever you have some great achievement, it is a result of your past activities, of your past thinking and all of this stuff. So whenever there is a negative situation and you want to find you know, some good things, some positive, positiveness in, in it, always look for the lesson like, okay, this happened, now what does it reflect to me? Okay, maybe I did something in my past that basically brought me to, to this situation and that's why it is negative. It's just a result of it, right? So there is a lesson to be learned also in all of these negative things and also in the good things, right? But when it comes to the negative things, it always helps me to really focus on the, on the lesson to be learned in it and you know just focus on this that okay this this happened this is it is what it is and i just move on and take the lesson from it i think about it like okay this happened and i need to you know take advantage of this i need to change something adjust some of my actions some of my activities some of my thinking and this is it now with all of these things you know you can think about it as the perception the view of it always look for those positive things now whenever something like this happens go ahead and you know go for something positive try to really focus on those good things and the lessons to be learned in it now uh, obviously it's not gonna be easy if, if you are just starting with you know changing the perception and the point of view uh, your point of view then it's gonna be a little bit you know challenging for you especially in the beginnings you know and I can tell, tell you from my experience I was in the past I was always negative I always looked at you know the things that I don't have and I never really appreciated what I, what I already had and you know it never really mattered what great achievements I had if, if I had a great paychecks or if I had you know all of my friends I had free time I had whatever it was I never really appreciated them, I never even paid attention to them because I was always looking at the things that I, never, that I didn't have. Now, the biggest mistake that I did, and most of us maybe think about this, is that you know, it's good to, to think about the things that you don't have, that it motivates you to achieve them. Now, for, to some part it's true, but um, when it becomes like a habit, of looking only at the negative things or only at the things that you want and you don't have then you get into a repetitive cycle and you will just burn out or you know be literally unhappy with your life so what I recommend you and that worked for me especially is literally a gratitude exercise which means every morning when I wake up and every evening when I go to sleep I just thank myself to the to the to the world and so on that these are the things that I'm grateful for in general these are the great things that happened to me today in this day and that brings me into the state of mind that okay I appreciate what I already have and that is literally what you know you might already heard of the rule like attracts like so whenever you think about the good things that you already have you will attract more of those stuff so again it's all about you know being happy and positive is about you know the the state of mind about thinking about the good the good things about the positive things so this is basically about the positiveness right about how to stay positive so Again, if you want to stay positive all the time, you gotta exercise this. This you gotta do it. You know, try and try every single day because you know when I first started with this, the changing of my, my mind, it was really really challenging because we have those you know difficult times where where you just don't don't see any point of looking at the positiveness because the negatives are so strong. But over the time, when you will just do this on and on and on you will get used to it and then you will just see literally the positive things even in the worst things that might happen for you and just one more thing regarding the happiness um if you if you are you know unhappy in your in your life it can be you know your professional life your personal life whatever it is you have the power to change that right you have all the control you have all the power 
and all the opportunities and tools to change your life. Go ahead and do that. Don't complain. Don't use the, those, you know, um, uh, things that, you know, I cannot do this because they don't allow me to do this and all of this stuff because that's just, you know, an excuse. And no matter how reasonable that excuse might be, it's just an excuse. And if you really want something, you can always achieve it. So just go ahead, do those stuff that you really want. Go ahead and, you know, focus on those things. And, you know, if you are not ha happy in your job, then just change it, right? Don't say that you cannot leave your job or something because you won't find any other job or something like that. It's not true. It's just not true. You know, you are just a little bit, you know, scared of it. And that's fine because you are changing, you know, your routine. You are changing the things that you are used to. And that's, that brings, you know, that scarcity a little bit. But that's completely fine. Just go ahead and do those things even though you are a little bit scared. So this is it, guys, for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you get some, some value from this. Now you can, you see probably more about how how you can really stay positive and happy all the time. This is how this is how the process works. And listen, if you enjoyed it, then I highly encourage you to subscribe to my channel. Uh, give me thumbs up if you like this video. If it helped you, let me know in the comments below what helps you uh, in becoming more and more positive and happy in your daily lives. And I will. I hope to see you soon. Bye, guys.